All right, so we're gonna finish up our three sixths assignment. Consider the table to the right. So we're gonna put everything together now and think about this. Use technology to determine the equation for the line of best fit and the data and the correlation coefficient for the data from 1940 through 1980. All right, so if you have a completely clear calculator, which you don't need to do this every time. This is, I'm saying if that, if you run into this, um, since it asks about correlation coefficient, I'll need to go into mode and go down to stat diagnostics and turn them on, right? So now it wants a line of best fit from 1940 to 1980. Okay, so I can go to stat, edit, do 1940 to 1980. So. I'm going to enter my data and get my line of best fit. You can do the same thing. stat calc four all right so I got negative 2.9 for a no 2.9 can't field one decimal place okay so I'm gonna round to one decimal place seven four six five oh it's already rounded Seven four six five point two. All right, and then the correlation coefficient for this was two decimal places. Okay, negative point eight three. All right, let X be the year. Oh, now we want 1940 to 2010. Okay. Oh, I gotta enter it all back in. Stat, no, just kidding. So I have up to 1980 already entered. Oh, if, if your numbers are wrong here, this usually means that you made a typo somewhere in your lists. That's all. It's so easy to make typos as, as I make typos here. Um, that was not planned. But I did, I did think, you know, if I try to talk about this and do it at the same time, I'll probably make a mistake. Okay, so now I got that. I can do the same thing again. Stat, calc, four, blah. All right, copy past stuff from here. So negative 6.4 and then 14, three, four, seven. Was it 0.6? Is it, wait, wait, wait. Is that 0.6 or is it 0.7? So that 4, that means we're closer to 6 than we are to 7. So, yep. All right. And the correlation coefficient. Negative 0.93. Actually, I didn't pay enough attention. Is that 0.93 or 0.94? I mean, okay, <laughs> probably point nine three then. Okay. Hey, wait, I should have rounded that to point nine four. So I guess they take either kind of rounding. Um, that's cool. I would prefer you run that to negative point nine four, but that's all right. So look at these two correlations. We got negative point eight three and negative point nine three. So they both have negative correlations. The correlation coefficient for the data from 1940 through 19. Oh, okay. So we're looking to see which one of these is closer to negative one. 0.93 is closer to negative one. So so the 2010, our second set of data is closer to negative one than our first set of data. That means the better model, the closer we are to one or negative one, that's the better model. So the 2010 is the better model than the 1980. All right. Well, I hope these videos have been helpful. 
Um, this kind of took us through all of our little details. Um, yeah, this is actually the end of the chapter. After this, we're gonna do some review stuff and uh, and yeah, then we're gonna take a test. So, so we'll do some review and then, all right, bye.